Hello everyone, welcome back to another FIFA 21 video. Today I will be showing you how to make millions of coins through the bronze pack method ready for team of the year. So have at least 20,000 coins because uh, you want to make as much money as possible and you want money fast. So uh, basically just start opening bronze packs. Right, so as you can see, I have got four cards here, four players. One is rare and all you have to do is sell at least two players or at least three players for min price to get your money back. So as you can see this guy goes for around 200 so he doesn't go for anything. Just keep checking through the players because some of them actually like this guy I think he goes for a bit. Right 800 coins so you can list him up 700. I'm making literally a bit more than double uh, the pack's worth and you want to look okay he doesn't go for anything I don't think he will go for anything either okay so then what you do is you just store them in club and I'll just put him up there um, store them in club and then I'll show you what to do with them later so just keep opening them up until you're satisfied with how much money you have and how much money you're making Right, next pack here we have three players I think. So he goes for 500 coins. Then we can sell him on 450. Just making the money back there. Okay, he's not worth anything. Is he worth... No, okay, he's not worth anything. What about this manager? Okay, so just store them in club if they're not worth anything because you will need them later by doing this method you can earn literally millions within a day if you do this consistently okay as you can see there we've got three players just keep keep opening packs and checking the players prices and if they're worth selling then you can sell them if they're not store them in club okay it's not worth anything Okay, so we've got another one here. 200 coins. Okay. That Libertadores player might be a bit. Okay, 250. 200. Okay, so we get 100 coins there. We just made that. Um, Okay, obviously they're not on the market and these aren't in the market either I don't think. Okay, store them in club. Right, I'll open one more and then I'll show you what to do with the players that aren't worth anything. Skip this pack then. Okay, so we got some more players. Um, two, oh, I thought he was worth a bit then. Next player, 200. And next player is worth 200. Okay, so just store them in club and I'll show you what to do now. So, with all those players, what you want to do is go into squad building challenges, scroll over to upgrades, and then just put them into the bronze upgrade SBC. And then once you've got enough to put them in the silver, once you've uh, got the gold you you don't go um, and do the two rare gold players pack because what you can do is do these uh, player picks which you only need two rares so if you want you can do one of that and then you can do a few just to get 80 uh, plus player picks which I recommend because it's you get good pulls in these and these packs as well for this one you just need nine golds and the rest can be any um, uh, bronze, silver, like any uh, filter and yeah so that's what I think that you guys should do and yeah I think did one of the okay so one of the uh, bronzes sold there as you can see you do make money even if you want you can sell them for 200 and I'll just open a few more bronze packs okay okay so we've got a Brazilian here Hopefully 650, 600, okay 600 so he's worth a bit. And always look for objective uh, cards like what you need to get the players. 
what was he 600 650 or something okay so he's 200 not worth anything 200 not worth anything i think he's gonna beat it yeah okay store them in club just keep opening them and also i want to show you a um the gold packs because they're very good as well because currently the gold uh players just any gold rare on common the market is ex really expensive for all of them because obviously you need them for the upgrade packs okay so is he four three fifty yeah okay we'll sell him 300 obviously like this player see he's 200 you can still sell them but they will take a few tries of trying to get rid of them and we get another hundred um, coins right so now guys I'm going to show you the gold method uh, pack method so it's 5,000 coins but you will earn quite a lot of money because the gold players are quite expensive at the moment right so as you can see we've got a Barcelona rare player so he's about 1000 okay I will see okay, he's about 950 and I will sell them later see how much profit I make and all these contracts if you don't need them you can sell them like I'm not really bothered with the uh, the contracts and stuff so I just store them in club but that's also a good method but obviously you need quite a lot of coins but I recommend you do the bronze pack method just because it's um, 400 coins per pack and you're guaranteed to get um, your money back in each pack because if you sell all the consumables and stuff like that then you'll get your money back and plus you get like 100 coins 200 coins for free on the pack like i did i got gifted a few hundred coins okay so let's just store them in club sometimes you get like players that are worth 4000 just because they're rare or they're out of packs or they needed for SBCs, etc okay so we got a rare libertadores yeah, Libertadores player. See, so we've got one here for 3,500. We can sell him for 3,000 and make a lot of profit. That is very good there. And we got another Netherlands player, but he's only worth 200. English center mid. 450, please stay. Oh, okay. We got right back here, 200. Okay, so that's fine. We still made a three thousand on that pack. One here, two hundred coins. If I do sell it, okay, I'll just put them up for the market. Two fifty for lazy buyers. And there's a French. Okay, two hundred. Okay, that's fine store them in club let's open another bronze pack okay oh so we got four we got four players here 200 i'll, I'll just put them up anyway because i want to try and make obviously my money back also just look in your club for any uh bronze players that are tradable because they're likely that they're quite expensive at the moment on the market just see for uh, filters because that's also a good way to earn money so okay let's go on the transfer uh my transfers let's see okay so as you can see that uh, brazilian guy we packed sold and let's go on to the transfer market to see the bronze prices okay so if we if 
if we go on to bronze players and we put, let's see, because Brazilians are quite expensive. Okay. You can bid or snipe them. I recommend you bid because there's not a lot of demand for these type of cards. So, yeah. I recommend you look, just search up yourself like what. Make your own searches and just bid. Okay, he's bought. That was quite low. And. Right, so I'll just do an English one. I think this is. Yeah. And also look for leagues as well. Leagues and nations, because that's a very good way to earn uh, money as well. Just bronze. Like, dust 200. Oh, I wasn't concentrating there, but. As you can see people are listing up for 200 coins okay so 900 coins for the lowest player so 600 coins I'd say maybe less but just keep bidding on these 500 But I definitely recommend you guys do the bronze pack method because it's just safer and um, the players, it's just 400 coins and you get quite a lot of players in there as well. And you might get a few extra um, coins. Okay, so we've got a few players in there. 200, I'll put him up for 200. Like if you're desperate for coins, just put them up for 200 and they'll definitely sell because people will want bronze players just for objectives or um, yeah for like player objectives and SBCs okay so we got rare he's worth 200 let's put him up for 200 and I'm just not going to look at the prices because I know they're going to be 200 But definitely start with a few coins because it's better and you'd start earning more money. I've only got 11,000, well I had 21,000 but because I bought um, a player for the week in league, um, it decreased my coin total by a lot. So I just got this much to work with. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed that video. I hope you guys learned something as well. And I'll see you guys in the next video.